Seven years from today on Friday, April 13, 2029, a relatively large and extremely infamous asteroid named Apophis will zoom past Earth. It'll be easily visible to the eye. Many astronomers will study it. But Apophis will not strike us in 2029. For a time, initial observations of this asteroid suggested that if, at the 2029 pass, Apophis passed through a region of space only half a mile wide, dubbed a keyhole by astronomers, then it might strike us exactly seven years later on April 13, 2036. But, by 2006, that idea had also been disproven. Astronomers at Kitt Peak National Observatory near Tuscan, Arizona, discovered Apophis on the evening of June 19, 2004. The team were searching for asteroids low in the western sky. They were specifically looking for objects in the direction of the sun. The asteroid they found was originally designated 2004 MN4. It was 57 degrees from the sun, unusually close for an asteroid. But astronomers quickly recognized this asteroid was different from most. It orbits the Sun in less than one Earth year. Apophis takes 323.6 days to orbit the Sun. Earth takes 365.3 days. And Apophis gets nearly as close to the Sun as the planet Venus then heads out to just beyond Earth's orbit. Its orbit defines Apophis as what astronomers call an A10-class asteroid. Apophis is a space rock about 1,000 feet 340 meters across. Calculations in recent years have proven the asteroid will safely glide past Earth in both 2029 and 2036. In 2029, Apophis should pass at a nominal distance of 19,662 miles. 31,643 kilometers from the Earth's surface. That's in contrast to the Moon's average distance of about 250,000 miles 380,000 kilometers. And it's closer than many Earth-orbiting satellites. As the asteroid encounters Earth's gravitational field in 2029, one result could be asteroid quakes on Apophis. This passage will also change the orbit of Apophis slightly. Apophis made a close approach in 2013 with Earth. It was still nearly 10.6 million miles, 17 million kilometers away. Even so, we were able to acquire incredibly precise information about its distance to an accuracy of about 490 feet, 150 meters. Later calculations let NASA scientists announce on March 26, 2021, that Earth is safe from an impact with the relatively large asteroid for at least the next 100 years. Radar observations taken at NASA's Goldstone Deep Space Communications Complex in California and the Green Bank Observatory in West Virginia have officially ruled out an impact in 2068, the only year out of the next 100 that previously showed a slight risk. Earlier observations had ruled out impacts during the upcoming 2029 and 2036 flybys. This new analysis means that Apophis is no longer on the Century Impact Risk Table, which is a list of objects that pass so close by Earth that astronomers have not yet been able to rule out a possible strike. This campaign not only helped us rule out any impact risk, but it also set us up for a wonderful science opportunity in 2029. Astronomers in Hawaii studied how Yurkovsky acceleration, or pushes due to sunlight, would change Apophis's orbit. In some instances, acceleration of change in an object's speed and direction through space can help avoid a collision. Studies of Yurkovsky acceleration as related to asteroid Apophis suggest this is the case for this asteroid. Astronomer Dave Tholen and colleagues suggest that Apophis is drifting more than 500 feet, about 170 meters, per year, from its expected position in its orbit. These observations aren't easy to obtain and analyze. Factors such as the asteroid's distance at the time of observation, its composition, its shape, and its surface features, all affect the outcome. Apophis is now in a part of the sky that is not observable from Earth. It will remain so until we see it again in 2029. But, seven years from today Apophis will zoom safely past the Earth. This much anticipated event is a must-see for all. If you like the video, share the same with astronomy lovers, and subscribe to our channel, Secrets of Space for Astronomy Updates. Thank you for watching.